again when there was no return to who I was and none of me, none of me worked without them. Every layer of contentment abandoned my soul. There were too many things rattling around in my spirit. I just needed to, I needed to breathe again. I was losing balance of who I was. I tried bargaining with my pain. I fumbled around in my spirit, searching for confirmation through blame, but nothing, nothing could have prepared me for this kind of suffering. I was broken. I couldn't express my heart's depression, the agony. The agony just would not fade. Pain was all I had in me, and it leaked from every crack in my soul. The only thing left beneath the weight of my grief was prayer. So I. I prayed, I prayed without etiquette, I prayed until my mind bled scriptures into every chapter of my distress, I prayed until my spirit was raw and exposed for healing, I prayed until my, my, my soul extracted and kneeled beside me, I asked God, I asked God to walk around in my heart, flatten my misery, stop me into acceptance, fix everything inside of me that's tripping, Lord, teach me, teach me to cry. Summon my next tear, he healed me. He replaced my, my weariness with peace, my, my brokenness with understanding. He was my ultimate pain killer. My suffering died in the cuts of his hands. He shushed me whole and cradled me with understanding. But every last word I uttered, his first word was believe, believe in the child. Faith in all that I am, and you will, you will, child, you will. 